Hey guys, what's up? It's Nihon Tiger. How you doing? Welcome back to Rogue Legacy, in which we have to fight Johannes. So that is our big goal here. And unfortunately, we don't really have a great selection here. I'm looking at Darwin and Culp as kind of being the two. Culp might be better because he's going to have a ton of health. So I'm going to go with Culp. I'm going to try Barbarian King. We have 19,375 in our goal department. And we can use this on a bunch of things. I think mostly I want to go ahead and at least pump a bit more into attack up. To health, get us over 600. A little bit of armor. With 1685. Alright, can we buy anything here? 1450 to unlock. 1250 to unlock the sage chest. Uh, will this do less damage? Yes, we'll do less damage, but give us additional armor. Um, I'm going to unlock it, but I'm not going to equip it. So let's see. Actually, it's 16, 14. I will... T oh, I don't have enough weight. Um, so I'm going to have to not equip that. You... We have runes left over. Um, I can almost take the sprint rune off. Because we're not really going to need it for the battle. I, I'll keep it on for now. I'll keep it on for now. Um, we're not going to need this room. We need 2100 to unlock some of these other runes, uh, but I'm going to at least try to fight Johannes this way first. I want to give this a shot. If we need to, we can go out and get some money and unlock some of those other runes to lower the levels, to do whatever we want to do as far as health goes and whatnot. Alright. So, here we are. Why do you wish to fight me? How many sets of dollars? Blah, 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 blah. We talked about all this last time when you fought Lee Shinoa. Shut up, Johannes. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Okay. So now we gotta fight him, then we gotta fight the fountain. Alright. Do a ton of damage. Okay. Shoot out tons of axes. He said he poops, he poops axes like no tomorrow. Okay. Right. Nice, he's gonna walk into that. Okay, this is not going very well because I'm not able to attack him from range. I have to attack him close and he's able to kind of chip away at my health. The blade ball does help a little bit. Okay, yeah, he's, he's definitely able to kind of bully me a little bit there. This was not the ideal spot to hit him either. And blah blah blah. You gave me all this last time. We know what the deal is. So we might need to go ahead and get those runes. It might not be enough to, to just kinda Okay. Let's get the HP and stuff. Oh god. Okay, that was a better attempt than previous times. That up there. Okay, he's gonna just attack me and do a ton of damage. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's that's not very good. Sir Culp's been slain by the, slain by the fountain. Ah, oh, so let's see. Can we get a? Uh, let's see if we can get like a Hokage or something. The Blair, the Archmage. Yeah, EHS is what we needed before. We don't need it now. Powerful spell kiss, uh, spell caster, Lady Charlotte. Let's do you, and let's go ahead. I want to go ahead and see if we can get these runes. Which runes do we need? The Grace. Uh, what's the reward? I don't really care at this point. So Grace rune be one. I probably also want the. Yeah, Grace Rune 
and retaliation rune might be nice. So let's just get a bunch of gold. Really, that's what this game is telling me to do. Get a bunch of gold. Go out and mine some gold, Yuhan. And then maybe we can try we can try another Yuhan's attempt here. Just at the end of this. We need about we need about six thousand seven thousand, probably about seven, eight thousand gold. And then we can probably make a Johannes attempt. Just so give us enough for the, the runes that we need, perhaps. And I don't think I'm gonna spend anything on anything I'm more on skills for now. Unless there's an absolute proven need to. Cause I'm gonna i I'm gonna try and get those runes, those runes that scale down the enemies and see if that helps taking down Johannes. See if we can get the game to kinda work in our favor, I guess you could say. Oh. So let's see, we got a chest up here. We'll probably make sure we go up and get it. So let's uh what's in here? Bunch of gold. Good. So we are at we are at the end game here in episode twenty six. Oh and it seems as though brute force alone will not accomplish our goals. And that's perhaps a lesson in life, children, that you should learn. You cannot just will something into happening by simply trying to force it to happen. You have to work at it. And that's perhaps something that I will kind of try to do here. I hope. I hope. I'd like to get enough gold to be able to finish this game off today. It would be wonderful. But I would imagine, I would imagine it'll be over sometime in the next couple episodes. We're getting very close to the end. And then we have to think about, we have to think about New Game Plus at least. I don't know, if you guys are interested in New Game Plus, uh, give me a, give me a response in the comments. If you're interested in doing it, I'll do it. Like if there's enough interest, I'll definitely do it. Otherwise I'm going to have to think about it a little bit because I don't know if I want to, to go through the whole thing again. Even though it will be, it'll be nice, but there's no real reason for me to do it. It's not a series that is like, oh, you know, it's like a Minecraft series, but it's better off on my channel. I could do it though. I don't know. I've, I've guess I've just got conflicting thoughts about doing New Game Plus in Splunk and uh, Splunk Cheese. It's the other roguelike you play, dummy, in Rogue Legacy. I don't know if I don't know if it's something I want to do. I don't know if I want to, you know, feel like I'm ready to move on to other things. As far as games, there's other like I mentioned in my last couple episodes, other roguelikes I want to play, other games I want to give a shot. And the more time I spend on Rogue Legacy, obviously, the less time I have to play those games, and the less time I have to do other things that perhaps I want to give a shot. So it's 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 kind of the the conundrum of the the let's player. I don't really talk about that. I talk about that more in my Minecraft series. But it's kind of the conundrum of the let's player to figure out, you know, how do you make time for everything that you want to do, especially when you have a whole bunch of stuff you want to try. It's very for assistance. Hey, Herodotus is oval. We didn't even get uh, Ponce's oval, did we? I don't think we got Ponce's oval. We got Herodotus is oval though, so. Yeah, screw you, Ponce. Someone's gonna, have, someone's gonna have to look at my videos and remind me if we got Ponce's oval. Because I'm too, I'm too dumb to remember, apparently. Okay, that's a Doofus. Dead. And... We're almost at enough for, for one rune. One of the runes. We're almost at enough for one. This will take a while. Keeping gold. Take no damage. Okay. So we can just, uh, we can just screw this room then. Screw your room. I didn't want your stupid rooms anyways. Frosting, get out of here. There's a zombie up there. I saw a zombie snoop. Hi. I don't think we're gonna be ready to take on, uh, not with an archmage. I don't think that's gonna be the wisest choice to go into. Johannes in the fountain with because the, the HP pool is too low. Uh, we want a we want a high damage, high HP character. If 
we're gonna fight this. Oh god, this is a weird ass land of darkness. That is weird. We also can't go in there because it requires gigantism, and we don't have that. I guess we could just take the teleporter back. Maybe the easiest way to get back to the start. Yeah, so... I mean, we can obviously try. We'll probably have to give it a shot. Just because I don't imagine we'll die to a, a creature somewhere. Okay. A little bit of shot there, but get a bunch of gold out of it. I'll take all that. Thank you. And the extra chickens. Get out of the way. So yeah, I really don't have a solid idea of where we go next in Rogue Legacy, other than you know, go kill Johannes, go kill the fountain, go do all the things that you want to do when you be cool. Stay in school. Other, rhyme, other words that rhyme with ool. So we have the oval, we don't need to... Okay, let's take a small hit there to get the extra gold. And there's a small hit in the other end. Here we go. And that goes to forest. Okay, the forest is in a there's a chest out here, yep. I saw that. But the forest is in a really weird spot. Is this a a weird layout kind of map? Where the forest is on the bottom instead of being on the side like it should be? Which is interesting. I've always always found that it's a little interesting. Okay. 38, 37, we have enough for a single rune. And I know the price scales up, so we'll want more gold. That's why I'm saying we're probably looking at about 8,000. Okay, interesting. Castle wraps around. So yeah, we're looking at about 8,000 gold for all three of the runes that we're going to try and grab. Like I said, I don't think this is going to be the character that we're going to beat Johannes on. Just because it's a it's a low HP, high MP character. And that to me is not... You need someone that can sustain. And I don't think this is a character that can sustain against against Alex, uh, Johannes' attacks. Especially when he turns into the fountain, his attacks get a lot crazier. Ah, so there we go. Platforms are all set for us. Go. Nicely done. But uh, yeah, he's got some. He got some very, very, very crazy attacks, and we have to be ready for them. Get that guy out of the way. Get them both out of the way. Thank you. Thank you. Both of you die. Just die. Thank you. So that's probably close to two. But not quite two yet. Okay, he's dead. Good. There we go. Get some extra gold. Alright, screw it. We can't go that way. We can't go that way. It's too dangerous. But yeah, let's uh, get some health back up. And there's that's where Alexander's room is. Really doing a lot of damage to him. They are knocking us back quite a bit. Alright, there we go. Get him out of the way. Dead. Dead. A lot of gold. Excellent. These tall guards. You're supposed to turn around and hit him from behind. You can you can plank him from the front. It just takes more hits. And you have to deal with the knockback, but that's fine. Get him out of the way. It's a lot easier for me to take him out from the front usually. Especially since a lot of rooms they're in have spikes on them, so you're dealing with a lot of rooms where you have to make very pinpoint precise jumps. Oh, 
what the hell did he just do? You saw that, he like went crazy and sideways and did a weird twitchy thing. I've never, I've never seen any of the mages do that before. Totally bizarre. So we're at 5,500 gold. We're getting, certainly getting a little bit close to the point where maybe we can start thinking about a, a Johannes run. Not, not necessarily. Okay. Just don't even bother with them. 6073. Okay, they're both over there now. So I can just plink this guy away, chip away at him. We're at level 132. It's pretty good. I hate those. I hate these jumps. Because they're always really tricky. And, oh, we died. Okay, so we get killed by a wall turret. We got a lot of gold out of it, so that was really just a gold run. We'll see what we get here with the reroll. Smell Sword, Barbarian King. There's our man, Sir Lancelot the Fourth. 65, 67. Don't want to spend that. Because we need to come here. And what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we've got a vampire rune we don't need. We can buy the grace rune here. Need that one. Need that one. Buy that grace rune. Okay, so we'll use those two as our, our grace runes, and then you may have something I can spend the rest of this money on. Guardian Helm, I could do that. Uh, Guardian Limbs. So, no, I'd rather have the Sky Limbs, but I don't have the blueprint for it yet. Uh, I'll buy them, but I want to... Uh, I apparently equipped them. Okay. Interesting. So... It could be more magic, but less armor. Um, I'm going to take the ranger limbs. Actually, no, I'm going to take the guardian limbs. I'm going to take the extra health. Okay. So I have the obol. Yes, give it to me. I shall let you sell past through the other gates. There you go. Thank you, Sharon. So that's Herodotus' obol. And Sir Lancelot. Let's go fight. Our friend, Johannes. Come on. Give your spiel. Blah, 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 blah. Usual spiel. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. At least this time we have the... Okay, we have that. So we can just do a little bit of damage. So he's going to do a lot of damage. Catch him on the, the down low there. Okay, okay, he's just, he's just, he's just, he's just messing with us now. He's only level 71, so... Those Grace Runes did help a little bit as far as leveling him down. Took a lot of hits. Okay, this is not helping. We need something like a Hokage, don't we? MP recovery, okay. Okay, come on. Don't be a, don't be a dick about it, game. Okay, so he's just gonna do that. Need him to get closer. If he does that. I need him to not do that. Okay, we got him. Good. Good. Okay. So we'll need to pick these chickens up. We'll need to do it quickly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're at a fountain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're at a fountain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. I got it. I got it. You don't need to recite this to me every time, buddy. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Oh. And this will drop and then be a little vulnerable. Okay, so he's gonna do that. It's fine. Take the 
countdown. We're out of MP. Everything we do now is just gotta be straight up sword fighting. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Take him down, 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 big boy. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't die. Now. Not now, not now, not now. Okay. No. No, no, this is not how this ends. This is not how this ends. Lady Shinoa, go. Go, just go. Just go fight. Fight now. I'm not ending this episode like that. Not that close. Come at me, big boy. Come at me, come at me, come at me. Okay. Suck it. I gotta get out of here really quickly, though. He's gonna... He's gonna spawn in, and I'm gonna have to deal with him, like, right away. Yeah, he's right on top of me already. Go, 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 go. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Now you pissed me off, game. Now you have pissed me off. Because I am going to kick your ass right now. I don't care how long this takes. I don't care what this is episode-wise. I'm just going to kick his ass right now. Okay, got him. All right. Very quickly, just need to get to safety. We're not somewhere we're gonna be in trouble when he spawns. No butt missiles tonight. Take him down, take him down. Get him, get him, get him. Out, we're out of We're almost done. We're almost done. Done. F screw you. Screw you, game. I beat you. You have defeated me, but at what price? I may have slain the king, but only after he betrayed his people. 
Ask yourself what justice has been met. In the end, we are all guilty of the same sin. Look to your forefathers. Such is the cost for unquestioned loyalty. Dot, 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 dot. The sun. And forgotten how it feels. Fountain has been slain by Lady Jenny the Third. And there's a, that's the king, a king down there. That's cute. Suck it, suck it, suck it. We did it, we did it, we did it, 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 did it. And there's our total: fifty-five skeletons, ninety-three Mister Bones, no McRibs, seven Barrets, and seven Halfuses have been slain. A lot of gray knights, gray barons, and gray eaters. Oh. Holy cow, 169 scouts. That's a lot of scouts. One Keter. Flame locks. I killed more blaze locks than flame locks. Interesting. No pterosaurs. Earth sores. Oh god, those things are terrible. Barbados and Amon. I killed them twice. Zombies, lots of zombies. Lots of zombies were slain. Many Doombuses. A couple mimics. One single Salus. I killed. Sniper. Archers. A lot of Furies. I think I killed most of those fighting Alexander. There he is. A lot of corrupt, corrupt knights. Definitely a lot of corrupt knights. Botus. It's like Boris, but with a T. <laughs> Plinky, my stupid, stupid Plinky friends. I hated you. And Stolas, Focalore. Killed a couple of those. Didn't kill as many Charites as I thought I had. Huh. And then, of course, Ponce. We killed him. Slimes should be just coming up here in a little bit, shouldn't they? More chain tours than I thought. Specatus, that's what those are called. Okay. Spike attacks and spike tour. Oh, it's different sizes. Ninjas, Ninpo, and Impojo. Okay. So there's a third size we never saw. Blobosaurus Rex, those things are evil. I hate them. I've run across them once. And of course, here we is slain seventeen, because we killed the seventeen ones he split up into. But yes, yeah, I mean this is pretty much it. This is Rogue Legacy. We're done with the main game. And it was beaten because I am stubborn and I do not like to be that close to beating a game and then fall short. I was going to beat that game tonight no matter what it took. So I'm just glad I did it in relatively short order. And really that's it. So I, I've gotten a lot of stuff as game that I thought, as far as skill, I've gotten a lot of out, out of it, you know, I've gotten a lot of enjoyment out of the game, uh, the artwork is amazing, so Glover Kotaki, well done, the music is beautiful, Teptex's music is wonderful, get the soundtrack if you haven't gotten already, folks, oh, and the shell in the pit, he's also done some music for this, both cases, both are great, I love the, the credits here, it feels very like Super Nintendo. It feels a lot like Super Mario World where you see Mario kind of run back through all the places that he went through. So, I mean, this is all in all a great game. One I've really enjoyed. Patreon! He's a good friend of mine. Or I don't really know her that well, but we're acquaintances. I like, like the fact that you can see like Sir Hershey, Sir Hornsbeater, named after people, which is really cool. That they they named a lot of the knights after friends and family, and other various things like being useless. Thanks for playing. Total children one hundred exactly sixteen hours. Absolutely awesome. We hit a hundred on the nose. That's pretty cool, guys, but that's it for the regular playthrough of Rogue Legacy. 
let me know in the comments if you want to see me do New Game Plus, because that's the next option we got here. If you don't, then I have to say this game was well worth playing, well worth the price I paid for it. Absolutely wonderful. If you haven't played it yet, it's on PlayStation Network as well for those of you who have a PSN. It's worth, wherever you buy it from, it's worth it. Just go out, get the game, enjoy it, have fun, die a lot, uh, spend your points wisely, and your money wisely as well. And thank you guys for watching Rogue Legacy. I will see you next time with probably another game. Until then, take care.